Well, if it's perfect for the four hurdles, but Lauren Wells can do only what she can to get as close as possible as they are away in this 400 metre hurdles. Bura, Story, Klein, Wells, Tate, Selly, Corneal and Horbin down the back straight. The American has gone out hard this week and Cassandra Tate down the back straight going stride for stride with Lauren Wells. So they're the two to watch as they run away from the rest of their field. Now Lauren Wells starting to make up on the inside. As they go through 200 metres, it's Tate and Wells. This is going to be a great battle. The American versus the seven-time national champion of Australia. With 150 metres to go, it's Wells and Tate this week. The American giving Lauren Wells a good battle. Lauren Wells gets to the lead, though, and here she comes in the home straight. Can she get under that qualifier? 56.20 is the time we're looking for. Lauren Wells about to clear her last hurdle. She's got the victory, but can she get that qualifier? 56.20. That's the time we want to see. 56.27 for Lauren Wells. Oh so close goodness. once again. Oh, my goodness. And that must be shattering for Lauren. Oh, so close for Lauren Wells. Oh. She'll get it at Nationals. 56.20 is the time she needs. But 56.27 unofficially for Lauren Wells. I wish they could round it down to 56.19, but I don't think that's going to happen, <laughs> Rossi. Well, it's not official yet, so let's find out what it is. Boys, downstairs, officially 56.19 for Lauren Wells. Oh, yeah! She's got it. She's got it. Unbelievable. Well, you said it, all. You 56 said it. 56.19 on the board. 19. Let's have a chat with her. You're kidding. Let's get official confirmation of that. But if that's done it, Lauren Wells has just qualified for the World Championships in Beijing. Robbo's waving the red flag, I can tell you, as we just see on the screen. Oh, she's done it! 56.19. 56, oh, she can't believe it. Oh, my there God. She goes, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, she's going to have a chat with Tommy Nixon on the uh, in-house presentation. Then wow. we're going to have a chat with her as oh, well. We've she's finally done it, Lynchy. She Whoever's it. rounded that down, genius. What a genius. Well, it's only oh, worth a... suggestion, boys. Wow. They've listened to my suggestion he's now. Very, he's a big that's player a, in Victoria. That's a big Holy. round down. That's one of the biggest round downs I've ever seen. I've never seen a point eight round down. She doesn't even know. I had to tell her. No. Look at that. Well, that's that breaking news here at the live stream, telling athletes when they've qualified. I feel like I just did it. We'll throw down to trackside to Robbo with Lauren Wells. Yes, thank you very much, Mossy. Speaking of 400, we're 400 hurdles. We saw something special on the track tonight. Loz Wells. Well, the initial time was a little bit over what you wanted, but it ended up being rounded down. 50, uh, 56 19. Just what you wanted. How happy are you? Uh, I actually think I can't believe it. Not that I thought I couldn't run that time, but yeah, when the clock said, I thought it said 27, and then you guys are going, you got it. And I was like, How? really? How? <laughs> Look, <laughs> you've no, been, I'm absolutely wrapped. You've been so close all season. But Loz, uh, now the equation's fairly simple go up to Brisbane next week win nationals and you're you're all but there over to Beijing how does that feel yeah it feels great actually I have been wondering for a while now if we're actually gonna have three rounds or two at nationals because I'd given myself the option that if worst came to worst I could always go all out in the heat and then try and win the final just to get a time so yeah it means I can maybe try some new stride patterns um, that's what this season's been all about just making the most of the opportunities and trying to put a good race together. All right, well, well done once again. There's the Chinese flag in case you need to get excited a bit more.